My name is Rune and I'm a printmaker. Yeah, um, I graduated spring 2014 from uh, California State University Long Beach with my degree in printmaking, of course. Um, I started off just kind of doing printmaking as a kind of side thing. I mean, just like everybody that I've ever tried to introduce into the, the process of printmaking or the, the, the field of printmaking, they always ask me, oh, so you print t-shirts. Um, yes, that is a facet of it, but it's not all of them. Uh, of course, that is how I started off, but once I got kind of into it and learned all of the different, you know, uh, for lack of a better phrase, facets to it, you know, uh, etching, relief, and woodcuts, and um, monotypes, lithography, all of those things, I just fell in love with it, and I personally just kind of left screen printing off to the side, in a sense, but um, that's pretty much me. Um, my favorite thing about my art practice is just the way that it allows me to explore, I guess, who I am in a sense. Um, I mean, a lot of times people say that, you know, art is a, it's a form of self-expression. And for me, it's a, it's a form of self-exploration. Um, you know, I, I feel like they say that you know yourself best. And sometimes I feel like I don't know myself best. I feel like I don't even know myself sometimes. So through my art practice, I, I feel that I become closer to myself and closer to understanding who I am as an individual. A lot of the, the I guess, not objective art that I do, it stems from just kind of trying to figure out my own thoughts and everything. I, I constantly overthink everything and my mind just always seems to be racing. But um, a lot of my other work tends to be more, uh, I guess, fictitious in a way. Um, I grew up a lot watching Star Wars, Indiana Jones, you know, things like that where it was just a constant adventure and, you know, um, before I was an art major, I was, I was a history major, so I have this dichotomy between history and art and so I like to kind of just make up my own history in my own art, so. Um, I mean, I want to get my master's and teach at the college level, I want to be a college professor. Um, but realistically, at the same time, I, I would love to be a practicing artist and make a living of it. I mean, I don't know any artist that wouldn't tell you, you know, the same thing. Um, but that's ultimately where I want to go. Uh, I guess the next big thing that I really want to do, um, I've, I've kind of already started um, based off of various, uh, you know, South American, Central American cultures. I've begun to, in a, in a way, uh, create pseudo cultures or fake cultures. Um, so going into the beliefs behind the, this, this culture and their practices, their deities, their um, architecture, language, um, you know, art forms, statues, things like that, that's kind of where I'm, I'm headed. Um, and I guess a lot of the, the inspiration that I have for that would be artists like, uh, well, the only one I can really think of is um, Bouvet Lyons. Um, he's really big into that kind of stuff. So um, he is definitely a huge, huge inspiration for that. I am Rune, and I am a raw artist.